Hey, what's good, everyone? Welcome to Ice Rink Diaries, local ice man here. Now I'm here at Ice Rink Studios where the magic happens. My spare room, we're gonna have to get the computer because I need the computer to show you what's on this USB stick I got through Zamboni. Now, for 30 bucks, Zamboni will send you any machine's manual that you have. And for us, we have the 500 and 546, so they throw that on this USB stick for me. And I need the computer to show you kind of how it's set up. I haven't looked at it yet, so we're both kind of discovered together what it looks like. What I'm going to do is use my computer here, a little OSB. And one thing, I'm kind of fortunate to have a nice computer to do this stuff on because when I started editing videos, I realized having a, a decent computer kind of helps with the video editing process. And since I kind of like gaming, as you see with the flight simulator here, I have a halfway decent computer that allows me to do that kind of stuff. So I'm going to open up OSB, throw my picture up there in the corner, open the manual up and we'll kind of discover it and take a look at it together and see how it's set up. So let's go ahead and uh, switch camera views right over here. Right, let's go ahead and slide this over here, plug this in, check it out. Doo -doo -doo -doo. All right, we're over here. I knew that. All right, we got the service manual for the 500. Uh, let's go check these out first. Get the parts list for the 546. Service manual for 546. So you got both those. Condition maintenance video. Oh, that's nice. The video. I got that one on VHS. Parts list for the 500. So you got the both. Service information. General service information for 500. And hydraulic maintenance for the 500. So these are all just separate sections within the book that you get. And you got an ice resurfacing video in English and one in French. So cool, right on. Two videos in the shop books for the 500 and 546. So let's go ahead and check out the parts list one. You know, we've seen this stuff and it's nothing new here. It's just a digital format. So there's a Kubota motor right there. Is it Kubota? Yep. So it's, it's kind of nice having it on digital format, I suppose. I kind of am like a book guy. I like walking over the machine with the book so I could look at it. Because this is parts list one. Oh, colored pictures. That's, that's a bonus. Because this parts list, this parts book is why I'm in the most. The, the general information stuff. I'm not in a whole lot. But this parts one is, that's a, yeah, that's a nice little layout there. Okay, colored pictures. Uh, these pictures are in the book, but they're not colored, so I, that's definitely a bonus. So let's go ahead and check out the, the service manual for 500. Uh, we want continuous. So this is just your general information here. Star serving the rank of America. Okay, okay. Uh oh, where'd you go? Opera instructions. Okay, so this one is definitely faxed or scanned. <laughs> I can see it's an older book, so oh, that's 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 nice. Let's go ahead and check out the 546 service manual. I would assume this one is probably newer. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Color pictures too. Okay. I like this. I like this. So again, I get more of a book guy. I like having the book next to me when I'm looking at the machine, but that's all right. I think my dog just ran in behind me there. I don't know if you can see him or her. <laughs> if you're barking, you know someone's home. The Kubota motor. So this is specific to our machine here. All right. Awesome. Okay. Let's go and check these videos out. Conditioner maintenance. I have this one on VHS. So it's it's a good video. It's featuring safety but guards such as those seen here are available guard, for all so current and many VHS older Zamboni older machine, machine models. Yet between 24 degrees, oh, the belt does little to wear down here. the bottom of the runners. Complete I don't want to show you all this thing. Give away my content. Removal of the chain guard okay. should be done monthly okay. to lubricate the this parts. This is cool. I know this is the one that came on a DVD where we got our 546. So um, we got Richard there. Right on. Cautions Richard and warnings contained in the So this is a general people and use so one, I guess, wash water system. Refer to our video Interesting. Okay. Oh, well, this surface. is a good video. I've never seen most of it, but... And lift the conditioner to avoid freezing the towel to There you the go. All right. So I think this... I was first thinking for 30 bucks, this USB stick. Dang it. May not be worth it, but... Um, to have these videos on here definitely makes it worth it. How big is this USB stick anyway? Oh, I just didn't see that. 
eight gigs. And there's six gigs on there. Wow, that kind of surprised me. I, I knew, I thought it was about eight gigs because the man knows that we're going to take a lot of space to it. But yeah, I guess with the videos, I can see six gigs being on here. All right, so I think that's pretty much it. There's nothing too fancy here. These videos are pretty cool. That's definitely a bonus. But these manuals, I've definitely seen these things before. So nothing new here. So if you're interested in this manual, for or this usb stick for your facility i think it's a good idea i think it's good for training to have these videos for training i think is definitely a bonus and on the usb stick itself it said to stick it on excuse me stick it on the keychain but i think that's a good idea but i think our facility is going to get lost or stolen or broken because we use our keys to go out and to fill the propane tank we have the propane tank key on there to lock so we also take it out stick it underneath the seat so i i think in the booklet maybe the best in the manual the shop book that came with the machine would be the best way to, to clip it in a three-ring binder as well as backing it up so if it does get lost or stolen you can just back it up on your machine on a computer that way you could also have people kind of look out at the videos if you're training someone and if there's some downtime you can say hey i want you to look at this video or i want you to read this section and maybe online people will be more inclined or on the computer to look at the information versus stepping through a book. So I think it's a, a good idea to have. And if it comes with the machine, that's definitely a bonus. But if you have to spend an extra 30 bucks, I just ordered a thousand dollars worth of parts, the bushings and bearings and leaf springs. So put a, a thirty dollars on top of that, it's not a huge deal. So I think it's a pretty good idea. Go and contact Zamboin if you're interested. But I think that's all I have for guys today. Again, thanks for watching. As always, hope you learned something. And like the localized man says, but at home, stay cool. Got that done without the dog barking.